What is Delayed Launcher in Windows? Delayed Launcher is a part of Intel's rapid storage technology that delays the Windows OS startup process for 30 to 60 seconds. It uses the local run registry settings to execute automatically and helps to prevent any malware from accessing the system files. It also activates the Intel Rapid Recovery technology, which restores the hard disk out of the recovery partition. To access the Delayed Launcher program, you can use the Windows Task Manager and click on the Startup tab. There you can see the program name as Intel Delayed Launcher or Ihistoric and Launch.exe. You can also disable or enable it from there by right-clicking on it and choosing Disable or Enable. However, disabling it may affect your system performance and security, so it is not recommended. Unless you have a specific reason to do so. And to disable Delayed Launcher in Windows, disable Delayed Launcher or IA Store icon Launch.exe. The decision to use the Delayed Launcher feature in Windows depends on your specific needs and preferences. Here are some points to consider. 1. Purpose, the Delayed Launcher also known as the Linux Tray Module, is a component associated with Intel graphics drivers. It is designed to provide quick access to certain graphics-related functions and settings. If you have an Intel graphics card and frequently use the associated features, you may find value in keeping the delayed launcher enabled. 2. System Performance Enabling the delayed launcher may cause a slight delay during the startup of your computer as it loads the Intel graphics-related processes. However, the impact on overall system performance is generally minimal. If you have a powerful computer and the startup delay is not a concern for you, you can keep the delayed launcher enabled. 3. Resource usage, the delayed launcher consumes system resources such as memory and CPU usage. If you are experiencing resource constraints on your computer or prefer to minimize background processes, you may consider disabling the delayed launcher. 4. Graphics functionality, if you disable the delayed launcher, you may lose quick access to certain Intel graphics settings and functions. However, most of these settings can still be accessed through the Intel graphics control panel or other means. Ultimately, the decision to use the delayed launcher should be based on your specific needs and the impact on your system. If you frequently use Intel graphics related features and are comfortable with the slight delay during startup, you can keep it enabled. On the other hand, if you prioritize resource usage or do not require the quick access provided by the delayed launcher, you can consider disabling it without significant consequences.